on the UN Comtrade homepage, the first thing you're going to want to do is click the Get Trade Data button. And this will take you to the data interface. It's really easy to use. All you have to do is go through each section. So for frequency, we have to determine whether or not we want annual or monthly data. I'm going to stick with annual. For classification, you can determine if you want HS codes, SITC codes. I usually just stick with HS as reported, but you can adjust that if you need to. If you're not sure, just leave it with the defaults. Then under section 3, we need to select what years of trade data we're interested in. And so I actually want the last five years worth of data. For reporters, this is going to be the country that is reporting the trade data. So if I want to know about the import of wine into Germany, then I would look for Germany here. And you can just type in the box to sort through that list rather than scrolling all the way through. I'm going to get rid of all because I don't want to know everyone who's done this trade. For partners, what I want to do is just look up the information as to who has traded with Germany. I don't want to limit to just a few countries in this case. I want to know everyone who has done this trade with Germany. So I'm just going to use all. And for trade flows, you can select whether you're interested in imports, exports, re-imports, or re-exports. I just want import data. For HS codes, this would be the commodity code that is related to the product you're looking for. I'm going to get rid of total and start just typing in what I'm interested in. So I want to know the import of wine into Germany. I'm going to see a lot of swine up top, but as I scroll down, you can see I have a number of different options for grape wines and other flavored wines. I'm going to go with the top level grape wine option. And then I can go to the last section where I can preview my results and make sure I'm getting the kind of information I need. So as I scroll through I can see the various countries that Germany has traded with in order to get wine. You can also change the sort order for any of these columns depending on what kind of information you are most interested in. So if I want to see everybody Germany has traded with from largest trade value to smallest. You can see that Italy is their major partner in this regard, which makes sense. Once I have figured out that this is in fact the data that I want, I can use the download CSV button to download a file that I can open in Excel to actually work with this data and modify it however I need for the research I'm doing.